Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and today we're taking a look at a new game that literally came out less than a week ago called War Heroes. This game is available to download for free on both iOS and Android devices through the link in the description down below. I want to give a huge shout out to Fun Games for Free for sponsoring this video and supporting the channel, and to celebrate the global launch of this game for the next two days only, Everyone that downloads using the link in the description will automatically receive a free 200 bonus gems to give them a nice little head start. But let's go ahead and just jump right into the game here, guys. A little bit later on, I will share with you guys my clan information. So if you are interested in joining my clan, hanging out, chatting with me, all that good stuff, you will be able to do so a little bit later on. But on the home screen here, you can see we're already at almost 1,500 medals, pretty high in the medal system. We're already on the local leaderboards over here. Taking a look on the right-hand side, I think we are... 13th in local, which is pretty cool in my opinion, sitting in Warzone 5, which is only one Warzone away from the highest Warzone in the game. But let's go ahead here and just jump into our first battle, and I'll explain to you guys how this game works. So here we go, guys. Now, as we search for an opponent on the bottom of the screen there, you can see the map's actually randomizing. One of the coolest things with this game is as you move up in medals and unlock different war zones, each of the previous war zones is actually still available to you. Each battle, the map is actually randomized which is pretty cool because each map is actually different and it adds a unique element into the game in terms of strategy because some maps have like three lanes, some maps have like two lanes, some maps have like one lane. So each map has its own strategy involved with it. Let's go ahead here, drop a sergeant for that. And maybe go, go ahead with a bombing raid to finish off his helicopter as well. Boom, there we go. Bombing raid go down, boom. Everything's destroyed, nice, nice, nice. So we are facing off against a level 10 to start off here, guys. We are only a level eight. So already a two level disadvantage, but I've been playing so much over the past week or so since I downloaded the game and we actually pushed up pretty high early on. I think the first day we downloaded this game, we played nonstop into the uh, middle of the night because I was so addicted. Let's go ahead with an assault jeep on the right hand side there. Boom, there we go. Now the cool thing here is on the bottom of your map, you actually have three different bunkers and each bunker is a little bit different. So some bunkers have more health, less damage, and the trench actually has less health, more damage, which adds a unique element into the strategy of the game as to which lane do you want to push. Let's go ahead here with a flame troop on the right hand side, get some uh, APC action to support as well. Now I want to get a uh, bombing raid ready here in case it does something uh, swarmy. Ooh, this isn't good guys. Tactical squad go down, please kill those troops. That hell drop is actually insanely powerful, but we managed to defend pretty nicely here. Let's get a, a assault jeep here on the right hand side now that the tower is distracted by our APC. And I want to drop some riflemen to support as well. We are going all in here on that push on the right hand side. Now the APC guys, that massive tank up there is actually a high health unit that targets buildings only. And the cool thing is once it dies, it actually explodes and spawns out five riflemen, which do additional work. Now I think our opponent actually left the battle here after that push on the right hand side didn't work out for him. So good game to our friend there. We will give him a little bit of a laughing face as well on the bottom of the screen right there, guys. So good game to our friend Matthias up top there. A three medal win for us, guys. Boom, there we go. There we go, there we go. But that was our first battle, guys. I know it might seem pretty overwhelming at start, but it's pretty hard to explain everything in one battle. So let's go ahead here, open up some crates. I'll explain to you guys the deck building in this game, as well as I'll give you guys my client information if you are interested in joining. But let's jump over here to the shop, guys, and open up some of these huge epic crates, which are 3,100 gems per crate. Boom, there we go. What do we get? I really want to get some more uh, epic cards and maybe even some more heroic cards. Wow, we're getting a heroic card. There we go. That red card is the rarest card in the game, the heroic rarity. Pretty excited about that. Let's go ahead and get some nukes. What do we get? Some tank cannons, bikers, tactical copters, and what else? Riflemen. And finally, boom, there we go. Nice. One more of those. I really want to upgrade him to level three because it's a very, very strong card. So let's open up some more over here and power through. I do want to buy some gold before we finish off with all of our gems too. Because gold is definitely needed for some of those upgrades. Let's go ahead, unlock a new card right there. Boom, 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 boom. And for the epic card, what do we get? There we go, nice. Let's keep it going, guys. Let's keep it going. We'll open up a couple more, then do another battle. I'll give you guys my client information. Then we'll open up some more crates to finish the video off. Let's go ahead here. There we go. What do we get? What do we get? Another heroic card, guys. Wow. We will open that one up last, guys, because it's so crazy. Let's go ahead. Boom, boom, boom. There we go. Heroic card, what do we get? A brand new one, guys. Yes, there we go. I really won that one. It was so strong when paired up with an all-air deck, because what it does, I'll explain to you guys later what it does, because it's pretty cool. Uh, let's go ahead here, open up, maybe two more, and then we'll go into the deck building of this game. Let's go ahead, there we go. Another heroic card, guys, yes. Why am I so lucky today? Boom, boom, boom. Epic card, there we go. And for the heroic, what do we get? Yes, another one, we can upgrade it to level two. 
There we go, boys. And finally, for our last epic crate of this opening, for now, until later, we get another heroic as three in a row. So lucky today. Let's go. Boom, 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 boom. There we go. And for the heroic card, yes, almost level three. I like it, guys. I like it for sure. Let's go ahead down here and buy some gold as well, because gold is definitely important for those upgrades. So, boom. There we go, 100,000 gold. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. So let's jump over here into the deck building of this game, guys. So this is a card collection game. So as any card collection game, you unlock and upgrade different cards as you open up those crates. And taking a look up here, guys, you have eight cards in your deck. But the cool thing here is, not only do you have your battle deck, but you also have what they call generals, which adds a really unique strategy element into the game. And what each general does is gives you a unique ability in your gameplay. So taking a look at the generals down here, guys, some generals give you a free tank every minute, literally, just a free tank spawns on your base every single minute in the game. Some of them give you a shield on all of your units. Some of them give you a shield on all of your bunkers. The one that I'm using actually gives me an extra soldier on my trench as well as my spawn bunker, which drastically increases the DPS of your bunkers. The other one that I really want to try out here, the other two ones I want to try out, is this one right here, which actually gives your bunkers splash damage, which is actually pretty powerful. And the one we just unlocked, the new heroic card, which actually enables all of your flying vehicles, when they die, they actually crash land and do splash damage to anything beneath it, which is a very powerful ability to have. But I want to stick to the one that we're still using right now, which increases the DPS of each of our bunkers. I do want to make a couple changes to my deck, though. First of all, we ought to upgrade a couple of these cards right here. The Rifleman going to level 10. Boom, there we go. Maybe even one level higher? Do we? Level 11? No, not quite, not quite, guys. Only 16 cards away from level 11 right Let's go ahead and upgrade our Assault Jeep as well. That is a pretty powerful card. And I want to throw in one new card into this deck over here. So Assault Jeep upgrade. There we go. Thank you. Let's go ahead and throw in the Nuke card because the Nuke is extremely powerful and extremely strong. It is pretty expensive, costing 7 energy, but so much damage. Let's go ahead here, throw that in there right there and upgrade it a couple of times. Boom, there we go. Level 2. And can we go to level three here pretty soon? Yes, we can. Thank you. Level four as well. Maybe level five? Level five nuke? Wow, guys, it's gonna be so nasty. Level six as well. I can't believe it, guys. Our highest level card in our deck is that nuke. Boom, there we go. How much damage per nuke? We will find out soon. 2,300 damage per nuke. Almost 1,000 damage on the building. Each time you use that new guys, so incredibly powerful. Now, before we go to some more battles, I do want to quickly share with you guys my clan information if you are interested in joining. So, taking a look at the social tab over here, my clan is called War with Shane, all one word. Gonna go ahead and open up the clan as soon as this video goes live. If you are interested in joining the clan, make sure you comment down below your username in this game, and I will go ahead and accept you in the clan. Now, the Castle Crush clan actually filled up insanely fast. So if you guys are interested in joining, make sure you download pretty quickly because it does fill up pretty fast as well. And once this video is live, I will spend some time hanging out with you guys on this clan, chatting with you guys, discussing strategy, all of that good stuff. Let's go ahead here, jump into our very next battle with our recently upgraded deck. Then we'll open up some more crates afterwards. So now we have a new war zone here. Like I said before, guys, each battle has a random war zone. So there we go, guys. Raise your shield. He has the same general as the last guy did. But I actually prefer the... Um, the more troops in my tower kind of thing. I was actually using the shield one before that one, but I unlocked this heroic one, and I like it pretty much. So let's go ahead, um, get that going on there. Let's get an assault jeep in front or back, back here, and an APC up top there, guys, to do work. So his tank doing some massive damage to our bunker. Let's go ahead and drop an air support kill this squad here. Air support, go down, please. Boom! The APC is so tanky, guys. Assault jeep getting in there. APC exploding. A million riflemen down, doing a million damage to his bunker, and boom, down it goes. Super quick. So let's keep the pressure up. Actually, let's reel it back here, guys. That, that push is almost dead here. Do I want to go for the three or for the two? The questions, guys. A million questions, a million answers. What do we want to do? Um, I, I kind of want to do an assault or a tactical squad here for his helicopters. There we go. Boom. Nice, nice, nice. We'll get a flame trooper up front to tank for this uh, squad here. Thank you, thank you. And an assault jeep as well. We are going for that three, guys. Oh, the airdrop, guys. Oh, no, we're in trouble here. We're in big trouble. Airdrop doing work. Defend, 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 guys. Oh, but the push is dead. Tower's dead. Good game, sir. Wow, guys. Let's go ahead here and open up those crates that I wanted to open up early on. Got a rare crate, guys. Nice, nice, nice. Let's go ahead here. Tap to continue. Thank you. I want to open up that rare crate as well. Start unlocking. We're going to go ahead here. Boom. There we go. What do we get? What do we get? A couple of cards. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Go to the shop this time and open up some more crates down here. Huge, epic crate. Definitely huge. Definitely epic. There we go. Open now. Give me some gems. Another heroic card, guys. Wow. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give please. Boom, there we go. More heroics. Nice. 
I might try an all air deck after unlocking that air general right. Let's go ahead. Boom. Epic crate. There we go. Give me some more cards. Unfortunately, no heroic card this time, but we had a pretty good run right there. Let's go. Boom, boom, boom. More cards. A new card unlocked. What do we get? The Tiger Tank, guys. That is a long range, high damage tank. Pretty beefy unit, but pretty expensive as well. Uh, we have a couple more crates to open up here. What do we get? What do we get? Give me some good stuff. Boom. I love the animation when you open up one of these crates. The massive ray of light. Hype, guys. Pretty hype. Let's go ahead here. Boom. There we go. Uh, let's keep it going. We've got 20,000 more gems to spend here. We'll try and speed it up a little bit. Boom. There we go. What do we get? What do we get? Nice. More APC. I definitely use that card a lot. And the air support as well. Me likey. Keep it going. Keep it going. Uh, there we go. More APC as well. Recommend as well. I like it. 14,000 gems to go, guys. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, new card. Barracks. Nice. I like it, guys. It works pretty well with the general that supports spawner decks. There we go. And uh, we got three more crates, I think, right here. What do we get? There we go. There we go. There we go. More air support cards. More flame trooper. I like it. And over here, what do we got? I want some more air units because I want to use the air general here soon. Boom. There we go. One more of those heroic cards. And we got one more crate to open up, guys. Wish me luck for a final heroic card. Boom. There we go. What do we get? What do we get? Nice. And for the epic, boom. Yes. I like it, guys. I like it for sure. Let's go ahead here. Jump on over to our deck and make some final upgrades. Rifleman to level 11. There we go. We're going to upgrade our sergeant as well to level uh, 10, I believe. Or level 11 as well. Nice. I like it. Our APC can go up as well. I use the APC a lot. It is a really beefy tank. Has almost 6,000 health after this upgrade, guys. Nice. And it also spawns out Rifleman as well. So let's go ahead and upgrade that. Upgrade our air support card. There we go. Upgrade our flame trooper. He's pretty strong as well. And then upgrade our nuke finally. Level 7 nuke, guys. Nasty. Look how much damage it does, guys. Look how much damage it does. 2,500 damage, over 1,000 building damage as well. So strong. All right, guys, so I went ahead and built an all-air deck, or almost an all-air deck, with our new heroic carbon that we just unlocked, which actually buffs all of the air units. Let's go ahead, upgrade him to level 2. Boom, there we go. Nice. And then we're going to upgrade all of our rest of our cards here. Helipad upgrade as well. Uh, let's go ahead. Boom. I'm going to go through this as fast as I possibly can, guys, because we've got a lot of upgrades to do here. Level 5. Uh... There we go. Level 5, level 6, level 7, level 8, level 9, and level 10. Actually, level 10? No, level 7. Alright, I'm okay with that. Let's go ahead and upgrade our Assault Chopper as well. Nice, nice, nice. What level is this going to go to? Level 3, level 4? Pretty high up there, guys. Nice, level 5 maybe. Maybe even level 6? No, just level 5. Alright, I'm okay with that for sure. And our tactical copy, we got a million upgrades to do here. Boom, boom, boom. One more boom, and then finally six more booms here. Man, this is a crazy high level. How high can we go? Level 11? Level 12? Level a million? Just level 11, guys. So there we go. So with our new general, our new heroic card, each flying unit, when it gets destroyed, actually crash lands and does splash damage to everything underneath it, which is pretty cool. Let's go ahead here, jump into a battle with our new deck. I have no idea how to play this deck because I have no experience with air cards so far. But we actually have a different map so far, guys, with one massive lane in the middle right there. Pretty cool. Let's go ahead here and get um, maybe our sergeant to kind of get, get, get things going on here with our sergeant back there. Boom. We actually upgraded to level 10 here. Super hyped about that. So he's got a, a helipad there. He's laughing. He's having a good time, guys. We're going to give him a little salute right there. Assault chopper, do work, please. Uh, air support, kill his helicopters, please. Get some tactical squad down here. Boom. There we go. Get their helicopter, do work, please. Yes. Everything's dead. Crash land, please. Watch, guys. They crash land, do damage as they die. That's sweet. Is it gonna crash? Boom, there we go. Oh, it missed it, it missed it, guys. So close, but so far. Okay, get our, that's gonna die pretty quickly there. Okay, we've got a helipad spawning on some air units right here. Um, oh, he's got that massive, I don't have that card unlocked just yet, guys, but it is very, very strong. So we gotta kinda, we're in trouble here, guys, we're in trouble. That helicopter is so powerful. Watch how much damage it does. And the only downside to the helicopter is it doesn't actually target air units, so we may be able to swarm it right here with this. Kill it, please. Air support, do work. Whoa, guys, so close. If that thing lost into your tower for one second, it does work. Let's go ahead here. Uh, nuke this. Come on, kill everything, nuke. Boom. Destroying everything, taking his shield out as well. Let's get another health pad over here to spawn out some more uh, copters. And each one that dies, guys, does damage that bunker with that general effect. I love the... Um, the different generals in this game, it just adds a really unique element of strategy into the game as well. Um, each, each general has a, a unique ability, which is pretty cool. Now, if you guys could create your own unique ability general, or any card, what would it be and why? Let's go ahead here with air support, boom. 
There we go. Let's get an APC down here to get some damage down here. And we got some support carts, copters, helicopters, everything, air units. Um, oh, I want my nuke so bad, guys. Give me my nuke, please. Me need nuke now, please. Nuke everything. Nuke go down. Boom. There we go, guys. Everything is dead. Our helicopters are still alive. How's our friend doing there? Let's give him a little laughing face right there because he laughed at us earlier on. There we go. Let's get another helipad down here. He's having a good time, guys. Angry face. We're angry. I love the emails, guys. It's so funny. Like, he's actually laughing. There we go. Let's go uh, assault chopper back here. And I get another APC back here as well. APC there. He just supported his ground there. I'm not too sure what's going on right there, but he might have misclicked. There we go, guys. Come on, come on, come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I want one more nuke to finish the video off here, guys. One more nuke. Give me a nuke. Oh, we're out of time, guys. We are out of time. But we do have ourselves a solid W right there against our friend, Mr. Laughing Face there. Common crate, thank you. We're already now in the metal system, guys. Oh, we got a badge crate here. What do we get? What do we get? What do we get? Some jams? Some cards? Not bad, not bad, not bad. So are we on local leaderboards now? Where are we? Top 8, guys. Wow. Moving up in the ladder. There we go, guys. Unlock that. But anyways, guys, that will be the end of the video. Once again, if you are interested in joining my clan, make sure you try and join it as fast as possible because the Castle Crush clan filled up insanely fast. If you are interested in joining, make sure you comment down below with your username in War Heroes. And also make sure you leave in your request that you are a viewer of my channel so I know who you are. But anyways, guys, that is the end. If you want to see more videos on War Heroes or Castle Crush, let me know in the comment section down below. And if you guys want me to do more videos on different games, maybe once a week, make sure to leave a like on this video as well. But anyways, guys, that is the end. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like. But thank you so much for watching, guys. We will see you in the next one.